Hello Kami Hante, welcome back to another video. My name is Berto, and I wanted to talk about Blazing because we got some new information, some new leaks. Uh, Nordas Blazing threw it out on Twitter and I was like, hey, I should probably make a video on this because they're very interesting and there's a lot of things to go forward here, man. It's a lot of things to go through and I wanted to kind of go over it with you guys so that way you guys can give me your speculation on what the characters may be because we got like a little hint on what they might be. All right, so I'm gonna go and I'm gonna start from the ones that we already know are gonna come out. And again, this isn't really confirmed, but because it was fun in the game files, my bet is pretty safe that this character's gonna be coming out soon, all right? So we got the fourth Raikage A, all right? We got Meiterumi, we have Chojiro, and we have Setsu. Those are the four characters that we definitely know are on this list. All right, now for the next, the ones with the question marks are the ones that kind of intrigue me the most. Because when you think about it, when you read the little quotes, all right, and if you guys play Blazing, you know what I'm talking about. Be uh, under the names of each card, there's always like a little quote, you know. So, you know, based on these quotes, you can kind of maybe assume what the characters may be. So, under May, we have proclaimed ideals, okay. We have a few options. In my, on the top of my head, I'm thinking of... It could be Nagato, it could be Obito, it could be Madara, but that's very unlikely because we just got a brand new Madara. It could be Hashirama, or it could be, I don't know if I already said this, but it could be Jiraiya, all right? Now, Jiraiya and Madara are, are pretty much out of the question, in my opinion, because we just got a new Jiraiya, which was Seichimo Jiraiya. The only other Jiraiya they could do is the Jonin one. And Madara, for, the, for the, ma the fact that we just got a new Madara, I, I feel like it would be stupid for them to release a new one so f so fast. So, I, I feel like, at the end of the day, we're not going to get these characters, alright? These aren't the ones that are going to go for proclaimed ideals. But, so far, I'm going to repeat them. Jiraiya, Nagato, Obito, Madara, and Hashirama. Those are the five characters that come to mind, alright? So, the next one is Heroine of the Battlefield. I... I only got three characters that could be uh, fit there. It could be Tsunade, Sakura, or Chisune. All right, heroine to me thinks of, you know, something they do that's heroic, all right? So, you know, healing on the battlefield is very heroic, in my opinion. Uh, Tsunade, Sakura, and Chisune, they can, all three of them can heal, all right? I mean, if, if you really want to push it, you can maybe say Eno, Fourth Ninja War Eno. But I really don't know how fast they're gonna go with the with the characters. It's not completely out of the question that they can do Fourth Ninja War characters because they 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 skipped ahead and did uh, Chikamaru the last. They did uh, Gengo and all that good shit. So it's not very, it's it's not difficult to maybe assume that. All right, it's not a bad thing to assume that. Now we're gonna move on from that to Thousand Mile Perception. Automatically, if we're talking about in a figure term of perception, a figure term, uh, it would be Chikamaru or Chikamaru's dad because they have a lot of insight being tacticians. They perceive a lot of things beforehand. So it could be either one of them. Now, if you're talking about, oh, another one that I just thought of, Meiterumi's uh, assistant Ao, I think is his name, Ao is two letters. Uh, he has the Byakugan. And he can literally see from far away because of the Byakugan. So it could be him. And going by the theme of these characters, it could very likely be him because Chojiro is right under him, right? So it could be very, very likely. Now, obviously, Fourth Ninja War, I feel is out of the question more because this character's theme is more around the basis of the Five Kage Summit. The Five Kage Summit seems to be what they're pointing at here, all right? Nothing else. Nothing like the fourth great ninja war, but the five Kage summit. That's why I'm thinking thousand mile perception might possibly be AO. All right. So darkness of deep hatred. That's five Kage summit Sasuke. It has to be. It, there's no other fucking way to go about it. Between a rock and a hard place. I'm thinking Kuratsuchi or Akatsuchi. Uh, for those of you guys that don't know, those are the two people that are always hanging around the, the Suchi Kage. Uh, Kurotsuchi is the female, Akatsuchi is the big fat guy that's hanging around the Tsuchikage, so it could be one of those two, for sure. Now we have Setsu, who, you know, is there, I, I mean, I, there's no sp speculation there. Now, the Will of Blooming Flames. What the fuck could that mean? The Will of Blooming Flames. 
Uh, that's a tough one, because it could be Itachi after he fights Sasuke. Although the impact raid that we got not that long ago, that's that's the that's the Itachi we got. So it's very unlikely that's him. Uh, the World of Blooming Flames. I mean, it could be Danzo maybe. Hmm, cause cause like cause he says the following characters are also in the data, and it says Nagato, it says Onuki and Danzo Shimura, right? So I'm assuming Danzo could be the one character with the uh, Will of Blooming Flames. Unuki could be the one between a rock and a hard place, maybe. That could be true, too. I mean, I, I didn't think of that, which I'm a fucking moron. Uh, Nagato could be the ideals one, for sure. Proclaimed ideals could definitely be Nagato now. Uh, now for the next one, though. Root of the Great Tree. Root of the Great Tree. Hmm. It could be... And I'm, I'm going out on a limb here. It could be the Spiral Toby Setsu. All right, no, not the one with Obito inside of it. Just the regular Spiral Setsu that uh, helped out Obito when he got trapped in that cave. All right, without Obito in it. Now, the one that says the world we seek, I'm thinking that's Setsu Obito. I'm thinking that's Setsu Obito. But again, it's very tough to understand like if that's it or not. All right, it's very tough. Uh, we did get a Toby on an emergency mission, but this could very well be also the serious Toby. This could be the serious Toby because if you're looking at the theme of the five Kage Summit, he is a very likely candidate. So with that being said, these are the lists of the characters that got leaked. There's other events, by the way, and I'm going to try to check them out right now while we're here. Um, from the events, there's one called, let's see, uh, okay, okay, uh, Deadly Versatile uh, Twin Sword. That's, that's, that's a, one of the events that got leaked, which it's definitely Chojuro, all right? No questions asked, that's Chojuro. The other one's called Underground Maw. I have no idea what that could be. The other one's an impact, though. The other one's an impact raid called Darkness of the Ninja. I'm assuming that's Sasuke. I'm assuming for sure that's Sasuke. And then, if that wasn't bad enough, we're gonna get more trials, my boy, called Prove Your Ability. So, more limit-breaking to do, my boys. <laughs> more limit-breaking to do. Alright? So, with that being said, what the fuck do you guys think the characters are on this list? What do you guys think they entail? Do you think they're going to be powerful cards? Do you think they're going to be impact rage? You're going to think emergency mission? Uh, we already know for sure that, you know, Chojo is going to be an emergency mission. So that's kind of bad. But, and at the end of the day, let me know what you guys think about my specific theories on what these characters could be. Uh, I'm pretty sure I hit the nail on the head on a few of them because uh, it's very likely from what I'm seeing that it's five Kage Summit. It has to be. All right. Anyways, guys, I'm out. Peace.